Hey y'all, welcome back to MK3 Firearms. Today we're checking out a Browning High Power that is a little bit wilder than most of the ones that we do. Um, case in point, the LOK or the Lock Bogey Grips. Uh, these are their, uh, the bogeys which are basically the kind of like a golf ball stippling if you will, but they are the palm swells. So you'll see kind of that random pattern of black and orange as they're at different levels and uh, as the machining goes through. But really cool, we love these palm swells. They're nice and they're very, very grippy, aggressive. Uh, something else, we did sights, but we did the Holosun uh, 507K. Now, whether you get the 507 or the 407K, they're going to come with rear sights built into the back of the sight, which is cool because then you can delete your factory rear sight and run something up front like a fiber optic. Uh, for instance, this one is the, uh, the Dawson fiber optic that has the high power cut, so we do not have to do a new machine cut on the front. And that's kind of how it sets in there. Pretty cool. You could do a tritium, you could do blacked out, whatever you want to do. Um, as far as the rest of the gun goes, we did the Garthwaite reprofile trigger. So this trigger is actually a Mark III Browning high power trigger because Garthwaite no longer makes his triggers. We have one here that we follow the profile of that trigger though. So it very much mimics his, um, very similar as far as looks and appearance. Um, other than that, it's the same curvature because we mimic that. The uh, high take up under the trigger guard, as you can see there, gets you that nice high purchase. You know, your follow-up shots tames the recoil or helps um, faceting up on the front strap as well, our, text, our signature texturing. As you can see, order the serial number as well, really nice. Beveled magwell, and running right back into the back faceting. And of course, right into the beaver tail. Running the cylinder and slide, um, commander or ring commander hammer, the classic. And some nice serrations, 40 lines per inch on the back. Absolutely beautiful. Of course, this guy has our single stage trigger jobs. As you can see, there is no take up. The wall is there. Nice crisp break, audible positive reset with that click. And the movement, as you can see, is nil. Pretty awesome. Nice positive on the safety as well. This is the cylinder slide uh, wide safety. So it has like a wide paddle. Very reminiscent of Garthway safety actually. And this is the single side, so it's just there and not on the right side. But they do make an ambi. It's a little more funky the way it sticks off. We prefer this one, but if you're a lefty, they do make one for you as well. But yeah, questions, comments, concerns, as always, leave them, y'all. This one turned out beautiful. And it's fun, you know, it's fun to be different. These orange grips definitely set it off, and I think the end result is awesome. I think the gentleman's really going to like it. Anyways, y'all, until next time.